is Sims, and we are back with more period cube in Heroia's Realm. At the end, we're going to get our good ending. Um, and then we're going to get our bad ending. And I just wanted to start here, because at the end of the last part, um, you know, I saved the game, like I always do, and then I was like, huh, before I, like, go back, let's see, uh, and I went back and, like, where was Shiki? I want to see if we have an affection meter with him. And we do! Further proof that Shiki is motherfucking Poyo Poyo. Because why else would we have affection with fucking Shiki? I'm just saying! If we didn't, and I never have noticed this before because I've never gone in to the affection thing. The grow old, you'd be like, can I, can we backtrack time? Can I, like, manipulate, since it's my soul, my soul would be, like, what it actually looks like and not what, you know what I mean? Like, you could be like, I just feel like being taller. I want to be a little bit shorter. <laughs> I want a little more drunk in my trunk. I would need a lot less junk in my trunk. You know what I'm saying? Like, that'd be really cool. I'm just thinking. Anyway. You just don't understand. This is the only way. That's why I did all of this for you. If everyone's like this because of me, then I can never forgive myself. I don't want to be the only survivor. For everyone else, I should have been the one to disappear. If the period cube and I didn't exist, none of this would have happened. Please, please stop the period cube. You're the only one I can ask. <laughs> what are you trying to do? Stop! Goodbye, dear brother. <gasps> oh my god! Dude, we just pier we pierced ourselves too. It looks like she's got been stabbed through. <gasps> Brother, why? Spacey's soul disappearing. That she would die. I would allow it. I won't. Shiki. My vision is getting darker. Am I going to die soon? Sorry, Heroia. I couldn't stop my brother. I wonder if I can see him when I die. No, because he ain't dead. Wait, this is a massive library. A vast, empty building. Thick books packed from wall to wall. Okay, so I'm still curious. What in the world does... When I was reading things like, oh, Heroia's route spoils a little Poyo Poyo's route. What does it spoil? Unless it's this. What does it spoil? Like, it spoils nothing to me. I have found nothing in here that I was like, I mean, is it supposed to be like, oh my god, wait, Poyo Poyo Shiki. I already, we are, again, we already knew that. So that's, I spoiled that from day fucking one for all of us. Okay, so like, but I found nothing in this route that spoils anything else because... To me, it doesn't reveal that Poyo Poyo is Shiki at all. I mean, I think you can, you get that they're never in the same place and like whatever. But, you know, and I I think you would have maybe made the assumption because you're like, Poyo Poyo, what's the deal? And like, you know what I mean? Um, But I don't know. I've just, I didn't find anything in here. Like what? Oh, Shiki's the bad guy. We've known that from the very first path we went down. Like we know this. Anyway. I don't know. A vast empty building. Thick books packed from wall to wall. I walked among them, crying. It was the same as the last time. I was still alone. Maybe this is where the dead come. When I was a kid, I came here after I almost died from the accident. A long time. <sniffs> Shiki? So I still look like your brother in your eyes, huh? That's fine. I just want to keep my promise. Interesting. With that, he took out a shining book from the shelf. Now, accept this. I'll give you what you've wished for. <laughs> Spacey, I don't cry so much. I mean, Lucky, he's dead. He was doing so well up until yesterday. Uh, maybe because I didn't say goodnight to him, he got mad and went to heaven. Oh, no, it's not your fault, Spacey. Dad said it was just his lifespan. Lifespan? It just means how much you've lived. But 
You'll always have to say goodbye sometimes. Uh, that can't be helped. It really can't be helped? Well... I want to see Lucky. So do I. Will we see Lucky again? I hope so. Ah! Spacey! This way! Shiki, you too! Let's go to the park and play! <laughs> so not, anyway. Okay, I'm coming! Oh, wait, Spacey, don't let go of my... Watch out! Did Shiki get in the accident? Shiki! Spacey! Did we say that both of us got into the accident? I don't remember. Shiki jumped in front of us. Mm, where am I? Where's my brother? Oh, that was me when we were little. What? Shiki! A vast empty building. Thick books packed from wall to wall. Where did you go, Shiki? Why is no one here? I thought of my brother, and then... Aroya waved at me and said, let's play. What if he never played with me ever again? I suddenly remembered that Lucky died. What if I couldn't see Aroya ever again like Lucky? What if I couldn't see my brother? I don't want that. Why are you crying so much? Who are you? Where are we? I'm something that's always been here. But at the same time, I don't exist. Huh? And now then, answer my question. Anything could be provided here. What's making you so sad? Because you're not here. I see. And then I guess I'll talk to you in this form as long as I'm with you. It's really you! So then, will you stop crying? <laughs> Are we saying that Shiki isn't actually Shiki? <laughs> like, this is interesting. This is interesting. Okay, I'm confused, but this is... Okay. Shiki! Th this... I was so scared, Shiki! I was thinking, what if I never saw you again? I'm so happy! <laughs> Sniffle. Well... E well, well, you cry even when happy. Because, because... Was this place scary? Yeah. I nodded and grabbed onto him tight, and he patted my head. His hands are warm. It's truly really interesting. Not only are you not afraid of me, but you hugged me as well. You're the first to do that. To add, no interest in knowledge. What do you mean? You seem to be a curious one. Good. And the state of everything... No. The definitive truth of the world. Huh? You're still too young. You probably don't know what I'm talking about. Wait, so you're not my brother? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So, are we saying that I... Again, Shiki is not Shiki. <laughs> Maybe. Interesting. Correct. I'm the warden. I'm the keeper of this place and its knowledge. The warden? I looked at my surroundings again. All these books. Is this a library? It's a place that houses the infinity of knowledge past, present, and future. Uh, people call them the... Akashic Records? Akashic Records? Akashic Records, location where all information is recorded dating back to the universe's birth. It is said to contain knowledge from both the past and the future. Interesting. Akashic Records. And normally the door of knowledge opens to those who wish for it, but it seems it's too early for you. Interesting. Whoa! Return to your body. Uh, those who open the door to this place have the right to obtain its knowledge. Uh, come visit again when you need it. I exist everywhere and nowhere, and I appear to those who desire me. Wait, huh? My goodness. Oh. I didn't know what I would do if you didn't wake up. Heroya, what's the matter? Sorry, Spacey. I'm so sorry. It's all my fault. <laughs> Little baby Roy is so normal. Your fault? It was my fault. You got hurt because of me. I called out for you. I waved at you. And I couldn't do anything to help you. Heroya, don't cry. 
I'm not crying! But his eyes are filled with tears. And the car came by, and I was surprised. I got scared, and I couldn't move. Shiki, he saved you. Did Shiki fucking die? Are you telling me that Shiki's fucking dead? That's right. Shiki, hey, Arroya, where is he? Oh, Arroya! Arroya was crying. His tears shone softly. It was pretty, but the sight of it gripped my heart. I wish I could have dried his tears. Um, but it would be really weird how we talk about Shiki and he plays with she and like, but Shiki's dead, so I don't think that's possible. But, um, but here's the, so this is a little spoilery, I guess, for Poyo Poyo's route, maybe, like, whatever this stuff but i mean this is something that's going to come out eventually and every route is a little spoilery for others if you think about it so that's right ever since then haroya stopped smiling it wasn't haroya's fault i was the one who made the mistake haroya who had always been smiling looked so pained when he was sad me too it hurt me as time went on things got more and more awkward between us i wish i'd talked to haroya more I should have told him I loved seeing his la him laugh. I wish I told him to smile. You should smile a little more, Haroya. <laughs> I wanted to say it. I wanted to see him one more time. I love you, Haroya. I want to see you. And then do as you wish. Mr. Warden? You remembered what you wanted. What I wanted. The thing I wanted the most. Stop the period cube. Give them back. I want to save Haroya and the others. But the period cube, I just destroyed it with the almighty powers earlier. Only you do nothing and give up. If I read this book, would everyone be saved? Power works depending on the user. I'll let all survivor die as you wish. That's so scary. But if I gave up, I wouldn't see Haroya. I would never see his smile again. So, what will you do? I don't want to give up. And then fear not and reach your hand out. You shall have the knowledge you seek. I nodded and softly touched the shining pink book. <laughs> now, go. All what you desire is in your hands. Okay, so maybe the warden in this place just looks like Shiki, but is not actually Shiki? I don't know. I met Natsu here before. Not to? A digital sea washed over my head, lines and lines of zeros and ones, but they're not random. Each one had a meaning. Haroya? The book is teaching me. The minute I understood their meaning, they appeared as warm lights. Everyone is here. I can see them. The people who were taken, their souls still existed. Radius, Astrum, Chalkis, Mergo, Libera. Heroia! Heroia was there. He was telling me to hang on and do my best. I can still save them. I focused with all of my might. The souls split between zero and one could be collected and realigned. I'll take everyone back home. We're all just zeros and ones at the end in the Matrix. <laughs> Open your eyes, Spacey. If you die, um, what did I do all this for? Spacey disappeared. Where did she go? Ugh. Damn it. The outer data's broken. I can't move. What is this light? Do you not see everyone, Shiki? <gasps> Spacey. These are everyone's souls. I'm going to return them to the real world. There's no way you could do that. Yes, I can. What was written in this book? The law of the world. The truth. The Akashic records weren't magic. Period cube structure isn't magic. You... Do you remember being there? Yes, I met the warden and received what I wanted most. All of the answers I needed were all in my head. 
I'm going to undo all the programming you've created. No! You can't do that! If you do... You were always by my side. I thought I knew everything about you, but I didn't. You, me, Heroya, all of us, we're not the same as we used to be when we were little. What are you talking about? There's no such thing as eternity anywhere in this world, dear brother. No, no! I don't want an eternal paradise, I do. I want today over yesterday or tomorrow. I want more days of joy in my heart. I, that's why I want an eternal paradise, so you get more days of joy in your heart. I want to support someone and walk my own path toward an uncertain future. With Horoya. Even if I fell, I could get back up and keep going, as long as we were together. Uh, uh, you can't! Uh, don't go! Uh, come back! I need those souls! I need them for Spacey! So this is a soul. It's beautiful. It's beautifully engulfed in light. Its radiance was so wonderfully perfect. Each emits the most precious glow. I still like touching and beautiful. Like, it's what's it's inside. It's what your soul that matters. See, your soul is glorious and brilliant. Doesn't matter if you look like a potato on the outside. <laughs> Every soul is beautiful. Mm. Huh? What happened to me? This is... Ouch, damn it. Where did the monster go? Claire, alive? What happened to us? And where's Amadeus? I'm so glad everyone is safe. This voice, Spacey, but where are you? I want you to live in the real world. Amadeus, where are you? I finally found you, Spacey. Oh no, my ghost. Spacey! Heroya, you can see me. Of course I can. I can find you no matter where you are. Oh, so overly romantic, I love it. Heroya. I was useless again, wasn't I? No, it's not like that. I was able to save everyone, thanks to you. I remembered you, Heroya, and I didn't give up. You remembered me. I thought you'd get mad if I gave up. Idiot. I wouldn't get mad at you. Heroya, he's smiling. I've only been thinking about myself. I, ever since that day... I was so ashamed and mad at myself for being useless to you. Even after coming to World V, I was irritated that you wouldn't depend on me. I forgot what was important. What was important? You working so hard like you were. I really love that. I love it so much. This path really is ridiculously sweet, isn't it? I guess you're like that. I fell in love with you. Heroya. Heroya's heart... I could feel it directly from our entwined fingers. Heroya's and my data. Our souls are melding together. There's nothing to get in our way, now that we don't have bodies. Is this paradise? Where everything merges and becomes one? A world where no one gets hurt? A paradise for souls and understanding. But I want us to be apart. I want to be beside him for support. I want to see his face. I want to hug Heroya with my own arms. I want to fight a lot, and then I want to laugh and make up. All right, there's little left to do. Let's finish this. All right. I want to stop the period cube. I need your power, Heroya. There's a light surrounding Heroya. That's such a warm radiance. This is the same light when I saw the Almighty last time, and then... The deconstruction process is so heavy that there's no memory for its effects. And then, this light. Is it really Amadeus? Yeah, oh, we can return to the real world. Is that light spacey? She got rid of her outward appearance as Data, infused with Arroya. But why? Shiki... Stop at this instant! 
I think what you're trying to do is wrong, Shiki. You don't know anything. Don't act as if you know. I wish I had heard it from you yourself, Shiki. I wanted to know what you were thinking. I wanted to think with you. That's impossible. I told you. I hate you. Well, I respected you, Shiki. You are my big brother. You were so cool. I still think I'll never surpass you. Shut up! If you weren't here, Spacey would have... If the accident hadn't happened, it wouldn't have turned out like this. Like this? Why are you getting in my way? I was so close. I regret a lot of things. The accident, what happened, and World V. But I don't want to pretend it never happened. And my regrets are all mine. I'll embrace my past. I won't throw it away. And we can move on from this. No matter what happens, I'll overcome it. So I want to start fresh. Along with Spacey. I'm gonna push through here with my fist. You go in and stop the period cube. What are you doing? Stop it! Let's go, Spacey. Let's go together. This is Shiki's apartment. Spacey! Uh Roya suddenly woke up and looked into my eyes. That's great. I was so scared that I'd never get to see her face again. You would see my face, I just would have been dead. I'm just <laughs> dramatic. I'm here. I softly took Aroya's hands. He held mine back. That's how he's always been, and it made me happy. So, are we back? Well, what happened to World V? To the period cube? I'll look over there. Oh, fucking static. There was static on the monitor. The game won't start. Uh, the keyboard and the controller are unresponsive. Then, it really... Yeah, thanks to you, the period cube was stopped. It's all over. And the mission is complete. Okay, when we went back into the world, we didn't say that, like, Astrum and Radius left. But I guess they did, because... Oh, that's it? That's just fucking it? That's it? That's... We're done? It's like, we're done? No wrap-up? No final... I know we get a final chapter, but it's like, that was really fast. It's like, yeah, we made it out! Okay, done. Wait, what? Like... Anyway. where it really was adorable. <laughs> Astrum and Radius are still my favorites, but Haroya's route was adorable. Unlike some other ones who were you're like, what the fuck? No. Just no. Like, I'm sorry, Demento's route. Just no. Again, I feel bad because they could have rounded out his character and he got a little bit of the shaft, so he could have been better. But I just, you didn't, I didn't really feel as much for him at the end. Like, okay, well, yeah, he had some cute moments, but 
he's a psycho that killed people. And I just feel like he needed a little bit more to work that out. And I guess Libera wasn't terrible, but eh, the lolly boy thing is not meat for me. And Zane, fuck that shit. Like, no, no, no. What the hell? You started out so sweet and then you got a little fucking crazy. And then you took over poor Demento's body. Like, that's a fucked up shit. <laughs> It's interesting, though, and I'm kind of, like, I, I like it for that reason, because it's like, that's some fucked up shit, and it's, like, a little disturbing, but I like that because it's not, like, your typical happy ending. It's a little fucked up, but, like, the merry bad endings are a little fucked up, but you're like, they're so, like, they're just so wrong, but they're so good. I don't know. Anyway. A few days later, my brother was discovered in a university laboratory. Aside from being physically weak, there were no other abnormalities, and he began slowly heading toward recovery. However, it seemed he'd lost his memory. Nothing from the past few years. No memory of World V or the Period Cube. He'd forgotten everything. <laughs> Thanks for dropping by. No need for apologies. I just wanted to clear the air. But, man, after it's all over, it feels like it was so short. Sorry, you don't have to to apologize. But my brother did say he did all this for me. I honestly don't know what exactly it was that he wanted to do. So the truth is still a mystery. Well, yeah, until we go down Poyo Poyo's route and we figure it all out. Well, even if he remembered everything, we can't bring back those who died. We can't bring back those who died, and he can't be tried for it. So the best we can do is for me to give him one good punch. Uh, Radius! Hey, you came for a visit. Oh, look, he's in his school uniform. Don't call me by that name. Uh, Ray, was it? And you're too loud. So many orders. So how's Shiggy doing? He just stares out the window. I see. I'll be heading back now. Oh, okay. Later. What do you mean, later? Huh? Oh, right. Maybe we can form a party in Arcadia sometime. You haven't learned your lesson. It's fine. It won't happen again. Yeah. Well, with that, no thanks. He's like, I, I used to love playing this game, and then I got sucked into it, and I was like, fuck this shit, never playing another game again. I just feel like the trauma. Don't you love games? Ah! Bunch of people just traumatized. Uh, I wonder if we'll never see each other again. That was pretty serious. Why don't you ask him for his number? Well, I kind of feel like online friends are just that. What about you? Did you ask him? We didn't really have that connection. I'm sure he would have told you. Huh? Why? Well, he does like you. What? No way. He kept telling me how useless I was. But at the end of the day, he always helps you out. Because you were working so hard. And judging from your actions, you really didn't ask for his contact, did you? No, I didn't. Why? Well, you know, he is handsome. Yeah, and he's a fucking idol. He's gor- he's not handsome. He's gorgeous! <laughs> Nothing. He's handsome well. Huh? The sound? Is it a message? Oh my god! The sound! Is it a message? Do you not know what a fucking text- Anyway. Ah, oh, crap. I forgot to put my phone on silent. Let's go outside. I was thinking of heading home anyway. Man, I was wondering what the message was about. It was Astrum. Recently, you've been close to Astrum. Not at all. I bet you anything he's a loner is just bored. Well, he is pretty helpful when he's helping me study. <laughs> so they are close. I wonder what the others are doing. Libera, Domina, Alf. Oh yeah, the Forte members supposedly all returned to Arcadia. Oh really? I heard rumors they went back in. We're on different servers, so who knows? Oh, I see. I'm glad they're safe. I wonder where everyone is. My friends, I have no idea who they are, where they're from, or their names. I wish I could see them again someday. No, maybe I just haven't realized that I've met them already. Oh, that's right. Arroya, hang on. 
I took something out of my pocket and handed it to Haroya. Wouldn't it be kind of fun? I want, I want to actually meet them all. <laughs> like, I, I mean, like, we know, like, Radius, Libera, Astrum, well, Zane, not really, Demento. Like, we've kind of all met them in the real world, but I would be so, it'd be so much fun to see the rest of them outside, walking in the streets, and you're like, that guy looks familiar. You know what I mean? Like, it'd be cool. This is my bracelet. When you were unconscious, I borrowed it and forgot to give it back to you. I don't mind, but why'd you take it? I was scared when I woke up alone, and I wanted you to be by my side. I'm so sorry. Spacey, I want to talk to you. You have a moment. Sure, what is it? It's... Will you go out with me? So fucking cute. It's so awkward. <laughs> Don't look so surprised. B but I... I told you I love you. Did you forget? I love how, like, in all of these games, it's like... Fuck. <laughs> they make you like... Seriously, Japan, is this how it works? Like, or you just do this in games like, I love you. Can we date now? What? J Usually you're like, hey, so... I kind of like you a little. Maybe we should go out and, like, figure out. And the love comes after, not like, I've loved you for years. Now let's get married. Like, fuck. I mean, damn. Talk about the buildup, right? Like, we're friends. We hang out. I love you. I've been in love with you forever. This, like, happens way too much. It happens way too much, and it makes me, like, like seriously? Like, like what is the deal? <laughs> like, <laughs> That's what women want. I mean, yes, we want to be friends. I want to have a connection with you, but like, for God's sakes, like, 20 fucking years is a little bit too long to wait for your confession. I'm madly in love with you. Can we date now? It's not how it goes. A little backwards. Anyway, I, I didn't, I, I didn't, but then, I mean, I never thought you'd just ask me out of the blue. I was surprised. Hey, don't cry. Huh? He's right. Oh, God. I blinked and more tears came streaming down my cheeks. I want to laugh. We're like, oh, Jesus Christ, you're not fucking crying. I would probably cry too. Weird. I'm not sad at all. Yeah, I know. You're happy. You cry when you're happy. I'm like, I, I got to tie my shoes right today. Sometimes you just cry for no fucking reason. I'm sorry. It was my fault. Huh? No, it's not your fault at all. I messed up, but I'll never take back what I said. I want to be number one in your life. Heroya, I've always wanted to be... Ever since we were kids. Now we can talk like we used to. I told myself that I should be thankful for just that, but... But I don't want that. I want to be by your side. And if something were to happen to you, I want to be the first to know. Good things, bad things, I want to be the first to hear them. So, I don't want to go back to before. We won't. You know, when I was little, I loved it when you laughed. He was always so close to me, but I was never able to say it to him. So now I'm offering this to him. I still like it. No, I love it. But it's not how it used to be. It's not just your smile I love. It's not enough to just have fun. Painful days, sad days. I don't want to miss any of his expressions. I really, really love you, Haroya. So, no, I won't go out with you. I think we should just get married right now. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I felt so much emotion, I couldn't express it. So I held his fingers. Um, so I'd like to say yes. I gripped his fingers once more. Oh, <laughs> Why does he look so, like... Well, I mean... He looks so disappointed. Close your eyes for a little... Yay! <laughs> oh, Sorry, I can't hold it in any longer. I felt his warmth as our lips touched. I can't hold back anymore. Mm. Oh, that's even cuter! Heroya's long sigh grazed my collar. I love you. I love you so much. Okay? <laughs> okay, thanks. I mean, I feel so calm when I'm with you. I'm so happy, but I lose my composure. When I saw you talking to Radius earlier, my heart was pounding. Seeing you two talking together that made me angry. Uh, no, forget that. That was a lie. 
damn it. This sucks. I love that part about you, Heroya. You idiot. I'll have the cooler parts of me. But I love everything about you. I wish I could be less nervous and could hold your hands more easily. Heroya held my fingers. I want to call you. To hear you. Me too. I want to see you even if we don't make plans. I want us to go out on days off. Uh, well, um, the location doesn't matter. I know. As long as we're together, anywhere would be fun. And I want to kiss you again. Aww. I'm not doing that. But anyway, I'm not doing that either. We held hands, the other arm wrapped around the other's back. Neither of us scared, holding on to what we really wanted. I now know that I can reach out for what I desire. It didn't have to be eternity. I want today over yesterday or tomorrow. I want more days of joy in my heart. I want to support someone and walk my own path toward an uncertain future. Even if I fell, I could get back up and walk again. Together with Arroya. Wasn't there one, of, and I can't remember, one of the paths that, like, Arroya just basically died? Like, everyone died. You're like, wait, but everyone's dead. A breakpoint has been added to chapter one. Oh. I missed the little whatever this was. Anyway, the Poyo Poyo route has been unlocked. Ooh, hoo, hoo. What's the breakpoint? Interesting. Anyway, um, we got to go into history. He's got his own. He did he, did he, did he? Yeah. Heroia, chapter seven, and we want to go. Um, Almighty level is max. Affection level. Change name. No. Why? Why does it always ask me that? Stupid. Why would I change my name? All right. So here we go. Bad ending. I mean, that was a long ass, fucking, good ending. Like, in the last part, I was like, maybe we could go a little longer. It might be like an hour and 20 minutes or so. Like, I was not expecting it to be 40 more fucking minutes of that ending. Like, I was like, we probably got like 10 minutes left. Oh, damn. I'm glad I stopped it. We would have been like... I was like, I was thinking to myself, well, you know what? If this part ends up being like 20 minutes, I'll just edit them together or whatever. But... Yikes. 40 minutes. I mean, Jesus. I originally anticipated, like, Heroia's route being... Is this as long? I think this is the fifth part? Um, while we're skipping, let me see. Yeah, this is the fifth part. Um. But I honestly thought his route... Originally, I was thinking, like... Because I feel like Liberia's route was six parts. But... Maybe I just talked a lot more in it. Um, yeah, how about Radius? If you want a demon player to do it, what about Radius? Hell no. I don't want trouble. Amadeus, you managed to put some spirit into this coward. Who are you calling a coward? I would rather listen to you than Radius. How rare for us to be on the same page. I'd rather listen to Haroya than you. If he didn't want to, I didn't want to force him, but... What? 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 Oh my god, Bird, what are you screaming at? What are you screaming at? Why are you screaming at your stuffy? Are you, are you, is you mad at him? Why are you mad at him? It's like just shrieking. I'm sorry, hold on. I walked away to be like, what the fuck is with you, Bird? Anyway... Don't lose to my brother. Don't lose to my brother, Heroya. I know, but don't put too much pressure on me. Oh, oops. Sorry, I didn't mean it that way. I mean, put yourself in my shoes. Oh, we're dealing with Shiki here. Okay. I love you, Spacey. I love you too, Heroya. No offense, Heroya. Your route was really great. It actually was a really good route. Like, I don't have any complaints. I'm like, but... I don't have as much of the feels for him as I do for Astrum and Radius, but it's just because those are the type of characters that I, like, adore. And, like, the super ador adorable best friendo. It's like, his route was great, though. 
And I do love Hiroi as a character. So, like, the earlier beginning was like, well, we're getting a little douchey right off the bat. No, okay, I forgive him for that 100%. Okay, you know what? He didn't keep that up the whole time. Like, if he kept that up, I would have been like, I'll fucking, I'll fucking nut punch you. But, like, I forgot about it. I was, there was a, in the middle of one of the parts, I was like, huh, yeah, I kind of forgot about all that bullshit he did in the beginning. Like, we were like, whoa, 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 why are you being a dick? Why are you getting a little forceful here? No, 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 I'm not down with this. He redeemed himself 100%. I totally fucking forgot about him. Um. Because you know what I mean? Like, you play games and you're, like, literally the Zayn route. You're like, nope. I mean, there were cute moments and great in the moment. You're like, oh, okay, Zayn, no. But still, no. But after the fact, there's some characters that you're like, no, I like this character. This is a good character. They're a good route. Are they the top of your list? No. But they're, like, the... Yes, it was a good route. And that's what Heroia is. I like the character. I like the route. He's not my favorite just because Astrum and Radius are my favorites. And like, but Heroia's route was really fucking good. So, I mean, he's the impy for me. You know what I mean? Like, not my favorite character, but my God, the route is good. And I do love him. You know? Anyway, so I don't care what happens to me. Just do it. Don't do anything that would hurt Spacey. Oh, so you don't care what happens. I'll do anything I can do. So, and then hurry up and disappear. Shiki. No. Okay. Haroya. Phew. Finally, it's quiet. What did you do to Haroya? I told you before. It's not like he died. I could have killed him, though. Don't do that to Heroya, please. I know. He'll be implemented into the new world. I'll make any wish of yours come true. Don't worry. No, that's not it. Bring Heroya back here, please. You can do that, right? I've never seen you beg so desperately for anything. It's so unsatisfying. Then what can I do? What a cute face. And you're on the verge of tears. It's all my fault. My Spacey is the most adorable. I wanted to see you so badly, but I refrained. I didn't want to have to wait until the period cube was complete. Uh, but you were with Heroya. I was so jealous I thought I would die. What do you mean, jealous? I love you. His lips touched my cheek. Okay, so this is probably the spoilery. Like, maybe for the Poyo Poyo, like, <gasps> her brother's in love with us. But it's been pretty fucking obvious from the very fucking beginning that, like, our brother's doing this for us. And it's like, oh, he's to protect us because he's a brother. like, I'm pretty sure he wants to bone us. I'm just saying. Like, I mean, but maybe that was just me assuming it because knowing that Cheeky and Poyo Poyo are the same fucking, like, you know what I mean? From the very beginning, it was like, well, obviously, we have a Poyo Poyo route because our brother wants to bone us. Like, I mean, I'm just saying, but. Do you love me? I'm scared. I wanted to step back, but he grabbed me. Answer me. I do. He was always so nice and warm, and he watched over me. He was my dear big brother. <laughs> yeah, well. I've come this far because I care about you. I was worried about you. Right. You've come this far for me, haven't you? You thought about me. He wanted to see me and came despite the dangers. That's right. Of course I love you. I'm so glad. And then go to the new world with me. A world made just for you. And no one will hurt you there. Only happiness awaits. Do we go into the period cube and Shiki's route and that's like the happy ending? Because that'd be fucking amazing. My happiness. Would my wishes come true there? Of course. If I listen to my brother, then I'll be able to see Haroya again. Then I'll go with you. Really? You've always put me first. That's the case this time too, right? Yeah, that's right. I created a brand new world for you. And there's nothing that's sad or painful there. Really? Yeah, you can now live in a world where you won't be hurt for eternity. Eternity? Forever? <laughs> eternity? For eternity? 
Yes, forever. Now, come and sit here. My brother held my hand and sat me on the throne in the back of the room. Oh, we need a few more souls for it to be complete. All you need to do is wait. I wish I'd prepared a cute crown, a tiara with flowers and jewelry, for the queen of the new world. We are Jackus and Virgo! Oops. I, I don't see them. Ira, Miseria. Oh, no need to go get them. I need two more souls. Perfect. Spacey! Spacey and them! Where are they? Well... You can see them quickly now. Come this way, little one. You look like a bad guy. How rude. I'm not lying. Answer my question, or else... I won't forgive you! Oh, scary. Don't avoid it! That's a difficult request. <gasps> That's the mission complete sound effect. Where did it come from? Get ready to die! Sorry, but in the world from this point on, no one can die. Bye-bye, little one. <laughs> He's fucking messed up. I love him. Give me back my forte! You're going to go see them. Here you go. Ira. Ira! Hey, you don't have to run after them so quickly. You'll catch up in no time. You did this to everyone? Kinda. No, that's awful. Die! Be cursed! Uh, go, my comrades! Bye-bye. <laughs> Miseria. The period cube is shining. Finally, it'll be complete. Uh oh. The system is restarting. And the souls are being transferred and reconstructed. As soon as I see you've been safely transported, I'll follow. Then, please be with me until I disappear. Sure. I remember on stormy nights, we'd sleep like this. Yeah, and you'd hug me so tightly. I feel really nostalgic. I always wish time would just stop. The world will be like that, right? Yeah, you can see Haroya again. Really? Yeah, he's waiting for you there. Oh, when it's all done, let's talk to Haroya about everything. That way, maybe we can be friends again. All three of us together. I thought you couldn't die there. Um, and it just struck me that, uh, well, okay, technically the world that, uh, Radius made, he was killing people left and right. It's the world just for us! And he was killing people. So, maybe he just deleted those parameters. I'm just, I mean, I kind of, I don't remember that, but the three of us, yes, I wish we could. It was fun when we were little, it used to be... I used to be so envious of those two. I loved them both more than anyone. If you wish for it, and then it can happen. It's your world. Right. Thank you so much. What the... My brother staggered and backed away. The knife still stuck in his stomach. <coughs> that looks painful. My hands are soaked red with my brother's blood. Oh, fuck! I thought we were going to get into the period cube and stop him from coming in somehow. I did not know we were going to stab him. How nasty. My brother's blood was gross. He tricked so many people. It was dirty blood full of deceit. But my blood is the worst. I could feel my blood boiling, gurgling through my body. But I don't care. This is all for the new world. Why? I did... This is... No. Why is the almighty power ignited during the reboot? I love you, dear brother, but I'm sorry. I don't need you anymore. What? Every time you come up in conversation, Haroya looks sad. I noticed that, but I thought we'd be able to be close again someday. I was so stupid for hoping that. You were my precious family. Haroya was my special person. 
I couldn't choose one or the other. But I can no longer call you my family. What the hell are you talking about? You said so yourself. That he loved me. He said it in a different tone of voice. I can make the choice now. I love Heroya. Stop it, Spacey! Stop the Almighty! Thanks for creating a world where he and I won't ever have to separate. Damn! Goodbye. We stabbed our fucking brother. Where am I? A long time. Shiki? So I still look like your brother in your eyes, huh? Okay, we, we can't skip this. Ah, that's fine. I just wanted to keep my promise. With that, he took out a shining book from the shelf. Now, accept this. I'll give you what you've wished for. That I desire... Hey, you came here because you have hope, right? Right. There was only one thing that I wanted. <laughs> hey, wake up, Spacey! Wow, that's pretty as fuck. You're finally up. You were mumbling in your sleep again. I was dreaming. Of what? What was it again? Don't ask me. Just wake up already. Good morning, Kiss. You always ask me to do it. Right. I love it. I want more. Now, now. Don't be selfish. No, it's fine. Because... This was a world made for me. Oh, I have a good idea. What is it? Come here. Oh, hey, wait up. You know what would be amazing if we were like, I want to be able to go into World V and I want to control this shit and make it whatever I want. So I was like, I'm bored with this world. Let's change it up. When I used my almighty powers, it was the moment when the new world, Arcadia, was being reconstructed. All of the world's components, all that was in the period cube merged as one with me. Oh, so she is the period cube. And there was Aroya's soul. I couldn't mistake it. I moved everything, all of the souls, and I scooped one out. I didn't need anything else. Radius, Astrum, Libera, the members of Forte, my brother, players I'd never met. I turned all of them into materials to create my new world. <gasps> Girl, it's rough! Oh my god! Oh my god, she destroyed everyone. Okay, wow, wow, wow. I'm like, <laughs> that's why I love these endings. You're like, they're so good and so fucking twisted. I only want Heroia in my new world. Wow. And that book gave me a lot of knowledge. I only need Heroia. I wanted a world just for me. She fucking destroyed everyone! <gasps> and this way, Heroya. Why here? It's so dark and gloomy, and looks like it's covered in blood. But I feel like we've been here once before. When was it? Who cares? Here you go. Is this a ring? Yeah, I found it in the back room. There are two with the same design that her brother was going to give us. I wonder who made it. Me or my brother? Whoops. <laughs> That's creepy. Wait, right? Yeah. Huh? Uh, did you say anything? No, nothing. It's like Heroya has no idea. He's like, we're the only people here. It doesn't seem odd. Okay. Uh, forget that thought. Give me your hand. I'll put it on for you. See? Look. It fits perfectly. Uh, give me the other one. She's like, let me sit in the throne of blood. Fucking insane. And this is beautiful. He reverently slipped the ring onto my finger and softly kissed my nails. I feel like a queen. Idiot. Here, princess. Yeah, you're right. Sorry, Heroya, but not anymore. This throne has been made from many, many bodies. I created this. But Heroya doesn't have to know that. Now I'll need to put a curse. Always be by my side, Heroya. Of course. I'll never part from you. Eternally. I'll spend eternity protecting you and 
with the treatment you deserve. I love you, Spacey. Such a fairy tale like happy ending. A sweet, sweet tale of an eternal curse. This <laughs> is some fucked up shit. I love the merry bad endings. They're so fucking twisted. You're like, that's so fucking crazy. Anyway, um, sweet curse, yes. Let's go into our album and check out our pictures. Um, no, CG's is what I want. Woo, 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 woo. So, I just like looking at the, yeah, so we can see all of his, like, boop. There you go. We're not doing that, though. We're doing that at the end when we're done. Um, oh, good. Haroi is complete. I want to see something. Ah, Dementos is complete now. Ha! There we go. So this was the other Demento one. We unlocked it in this route. So we didn't have it in his. So that's why we're looking at it. Because that's the one that we were missing. So anyway, that's that one. Okay. Ooh, that's pretty. Okay. That one's adorable. Yeah, when he was getting a I mean, this is... I mean, that's a little creepy, but... I was gonna say, this is, like, sexy as fuck. I mean, he's, like, holding around back, and it's, like, a little... You're, like, it's a little too rough and crazy. But then you get this, and you're, like, that's a little... That's a little much, but I guess maybe... Oh, <laughs> baby, you're right. It's so sad. <laughs> it's so cute and sad. Anyway, um... I love this. He's like, why are you staring at me? Oh, you're adorable. Uh, I do love, though, how uh, in her, in the very bad ending, she kept him. You know what I mean? Like, she kept it, like, instead of being in the real world, she's like, let's keep it like we're here. And he's kind of like, she, see, she's secretly, she's like, I don't know, the ears and the tail are a little fucking... She's got a furry thing. Like, she's like, I'm down with it. <laughs> That's adorable. His face is adorable. Oh, he's smiling. So cute. No, I'm not. And now I am. <laughs> that one's adorable. Aw. Yeah, it's just the two. Yeah, the Mary Bad ending ones are like so good. That's the Haroya we know, so we're gonna end on that. Um, but yeah, so yeah, his role was good. I I liked it a lot. Um, again, he's not my favorite character, but that's just because he's the super sweet like boy next door best friendo, which is the adorable route. But you know, um. There are sometimes, sometimes routes like that, like the sweet, innocent character, like, just get you and you're like, oh my god, I love him so much. But, like, I do like Haroya, don't get me wrong. He's up there. I think he, like, I don't know, Shiki might knock him out of, like, third place, but, like, Astrum and Radius are, like, both number one. They tie for number one. And, like, we'll see what Shiki's route's like. Shiki might be number two just from the, being a psycho evil bastard, but he's pretty... And then Haroya would be the third, but, um, yeah, so we'll see what, uh, Shiki's route, I'm sorry, <clears throat> Poyo Poyo's route, yeah, um, we'll see what he holds, um, when we come back for you guys tomorrow and for me probably, like, next week when I record, um, because I usually just do this on Friday nights, <laughs> like, I just record the whole fucking round, so I've literally recorded all of these parts back to back, um, just because then I get to like experience and have fun and like I don't forget and then I'm not juggling three games at once technically which I am but um yeah so anyway we'll see and oh are you excited we're getting closer to well sh obviously tomorrow we start cheeky I mean Poyo Poyo's route haha <laughs> wink wink um finally understanding this finishing the game which is gonna be like sad we'll do the like bonus stuff at the end um, and hear all the voice acting and everything like that um, and then probably when this ends within a couple days we will have um, Code Realize Wintertide Miracles 
So like for you guys, it's coming soon. And for me, it's still like a month away. <laughs> like not quite, but um, almost. It's a little under a month, but it's still like a month away. <laughs> so, oh, I'm so excited for that. <laughs> Oh, we had to have our boys back. I miss them so much. I can't say they're the ones that started it all because technically um, Amnesia Memories was the game that started it all. That and Mystic Destinies were the two like Atome games that I was playing at the same time. So, um, but I feel like Code Realize is really where we hit our stride. Like we played other games, but we got that and it was like, everything has just been... It's just been amazing since then because I that's pretty much, I don't know. Yeah. What other games did we play before that? See, I don't even remember the games we played in between like Amnesia and that. I just remember all the games from then on. Like, <laughs> like it's been like a whirlwind of games since we played Code Realize. Like, I don't know. But anyway. Oh, God. That game up there in my heart. It doesn't help that, like, the cards that came in the limited edition PS4 version are sitting up on my shelf that I can stare at when I play games. I should literally take all of the ones from Psychedelica and put them into something so I can, like, put them on the wall. But, like, I can't set them up anywhere. I'd have to, like, tack them to a wall and I don't want to put holes in the cards. So i got to figure out how to do that without, like, ruining it. Anyway beside the point. So, anyway, I will see you guys next time in <clears throat> Poyo Poyo's run. I was going to say Shiki. Anyway. <laughs> I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to see more!